Dad, I found cigarettes in Greg's jacket. Greg, were you smoking cigarettes? No, Dad. Well, he's lying. There's no doubt about that. Greg, I'm afraid your punishment will be four hours in the snake pit. Maybe that'll give you some time to think about what you've done. Oh, man. That'll teach him. And, Jan, I'm afraid you've earned a day in the Chamber of Fire for tattling on your brother. Ah, uh, smoking. How does a boy like that go so wrong? Well, they live in a crummy neighborhood. The Brady's? Oh, hell yeah. They got robbers, thugs, drug dealers. Yeah, you name it. You folks want some pancake? No, thank you. <laughs> See, that's the worst we got. It's uh, Jemima's Witnesses. It seems today that all you see is violence in movies and sex on TV. But we're in those good old-fashioned values on which we used to rely. Death and cry. are too thin. Can I please get collagen injections? Meg, you don't need to change the way you look. You know, most of the world's problems stem from poor self-image. <laughs> <laughs> Excellent. The mind control device is nearing completion. Stewie, I said no toys at the table. Damn you, vile woman! You've impeded my work since the day I escaped from your wretched womb. Oh, don't pal, honey. You know, when you were born, the doctor said you were the happiest looking baby he'd ever seen. But of course, that was my victory day. The fruition of my deeply laid plans to escape from that cursed ovarian bastille. Return the device, woman. 